Welcome. Welcome. Welcome to Knowing Me, Knowing You with me, Alan Partridge. Tonight, I am a rocket. Prepare to board Sputnik Partridge and enter the stratosphere, or should I say, the chatosphere. <laughs> Tonight's show is... hot. <laughs> How hot, Alan? Well, imagine Debbie Harry in cami knickers spoon-feeding a beef vindaloo to Pan's people in a sauna in Bangkok. That's half as hot as tonight's show. Because among tonight's spicy guests, I've got the hottest, sexiest dance act in Northern Europe, Hot Pants. And, for the first time ever on an English-speaking chat show, a jacuzzi! <laughs> I'll, be, uh, I'll be getting in that later. It's plumbed in, it's thermostatically controlled, and it's set on hot. <laughs> but uh, first, first an apology. <clears throat> In last week's show, I accused actor Roger Moore of being a towel thief. <laughs> this allegation was untrue. Roger Moore has at no time stolen a towel, bath mat, flannel, shower curtain, sponge, or any other form of hotel bathroom accessory. I, Alan Partridge, apologise unreservedly to Roger Moore for my ill-informed and ignorant comments, and I fully acknowledge that I am guilty of gross professional misconduct. <laughs> it's time now to welcome my <laughs> resident house band, Glen Ponder and Ferrari! <laughs> Knowing, knowing me, Alan Partridge, knowing you, Glenn Ponder. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Glenn, if this chat show was a train, do you know what kind of train it would be? No, Alan. The Chattanooga Choo Choo. <laughs> but, uh, seriously... <laughs> what was that whistle noise? What was that? Oh, uh, yeah, meant to be the train, Alan. Right, you didn't do that in rehearsal. <laughs> it's meant to be a surprise, Alan. Surprise me in rehearsal, Glenn. Don't surprise me on a live television show. <laughs> it's a little, little bit naughty, that. Shouldn't do that. A bit naughty. <laughs> Glenn Ponder and Ferrari! <laughs> oh, this show is hot. Can really work up a thirst. <laughs> 